Good evening and welcome back to a BMW video. This time it's a different BMW, not my uh, E36 31A. Uh, this is a 2013 31A, the F30. And in this video we're going to diagnose a front suspension problem. <laughs> So what we'll do is we'll take this car for a drive and we'll see if we can confirm the problem. So like I said this is a 2013 BMW 31A it's the F30 model, which was produced up until I think 2019. And this has the uh, 2 litre N47 diesel engine. Now, this engine did have a reputation for being troublesome and slapping timing chains, but that's the earlier one. This is a 2013 car, so this uh, doesn't affect this particular car. It's just done shy of 107,000 miles and I think it's wearing them quite well. Anyway, I'll, uh, we'll see if we can uh, reproduce a problem. Uh, it doesn't seem to be doing it on the normal roads, but I do know a road where it's cobbled and hopefully it should highlight the, the problem. So we'll just turn right just here. This road here, it does become cobbled. I actually drove it earlier on to reproduce a problem. So I'm doing it again just for the camera. I'd have done it first time around, but the batteries on my GoPro ran out. So I had to charge the batteries. You know, we'll, we're coming up to this, uh, this cobbled stretch, and hopefully, we should be able to uh, reproduce a problem. I managed to get it in the garage and it fits. So I don't know what I'm going to do when I get my 7 series if I get it. Anyway, let's have a look at it and we'll see if we can find out where the rattling's coming from. As always, I like to try the simple stuff first. Um, we'll just check this strut top mount. So we'll just peel this away. It might be a bit difficult because uh, we've got the battery cover here as well. Uh, there's no loose bolts there, so no. These these strut bolts look to be quite secure, so I think everything's fine up top. We haven't got a loose bolt or anything like that, so we're gonna have to jack it up and get this wheel off. So I've got the beast at the ready with a 70 mil socket, got locking wheel nut, and I've got the jack position. So I'll get this jacked up. And then whip this wheel off. So 
So I've got the beast uh, set it on number three. Let's have a look and we just my default beast is making short work of this. And out they come now. Notice there's a wheel bolt missing. So there should be five bolts, but there's four. But this isn't this isn't my car. But something I need to uh, I need to keep a note of. So get this wheel off. I think I've got them all out. Yeah, I took four out. There's one missing. Yep. Yep. So this is stuck on the wheel. Uh, To use the rubber mallet, because it's only an alloy wheel, don't be uh, hitting it too hard. I had this same problem with the BMW X1. I can see it starting to come off. I'll just bring the camera around and you can see, I don't know if you can see there, see the gap opening up. So I'll just put you back down where you were before. Just keep Try and get it back the other way. It's going to take a while, so I'm going to stop the camera here. Well, it took some doing, but I've got the wheel off. I've just give it a bit of a clean main surface. I've put some, uh, probably put some white grease on there. Uh, let's see if we can find anything obvious. So, I'm check these anti roll bar swellings. These seem to be all right. I can't feel any play. And <coughs> let's get the light in. Uh, I can't see any problems there. There's a steering arm. Get, get a pry bar, see if we can uh, find any play. Uh, is this a... It's like a drag strut. So, just a... No. There's nothing that... At this end, I can see. So I think I think my, my initial guess of the spring could be. Come on, let's have a look. Uh, let's feel for a broken spring. So there's the end of the spring. Goes all the way around there.
Yeah, without, without pulling the strut out, I can't really tell. There's something... I feel there. No, the spring's not broken, so... It's, possi it's possible there. Uh, possibly one. One. Oh, it won. Strut top mount, but... So far, I can't see anything obvious. So... so I think what I need to do is uh, have a close look, see if I find anything else. Uh, nothing so far. Well, I've had a good poke around in here, and I can't, I can't find anything at all. So that's that's got me, uh, that's got me beat. The spring's not broken. I can't see any plane and any suspension components or the anti-roll bar. And the drop links are a bit rusty, but there's no, there's no free play in them that I can find. So it, it could be the strut top mount, so all I can think of is just see what MOT picks up because they, they know better, do the, the MOT testers, they'll, they'll probably pick something up I've missed but uh, I can't see anything obvious, so and I don't think it come from anywhere else definitely sounded like a suspension rattle uh, remember this is a rear wheel drive you know, F F33 series, it's three wheel drive. But no, there's no, there's nothing loose on the brakes neither. So what I'll do is put this wheel back on. I found the other wheel bolt. It's down there. I think it's a knackered thread, but I'll be able to source a wheel bolt from BMW if I have to. And uh, I'm going to end the video here. So that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed this one. A different car. So please remember to like, subscribe, share, ring that notification bell and you get notified of new videos. As ever, thanks for watching and I'll see you.